This week on the Highlander Report, the 1st Armored Division hosts its first ever St. George's Day Ball on Fort Bliss, a formal ball event honoring St. George, the patron saint of armor and cavalry. 1st Armored Division and Fort Bliss Garrison Commander, Major General Sean McFarland, presented numerous awards during the event, including the Draper Award for Best Armored Company and Cavalry Troop, Orders of St. George, St. Joan d'Arc, and a noble patrons of armor. And this is the first time, uh, really, as a division, we've had everybody together and able to celebrate in this fashion. So we're very excited, first time ever. We think this tradition will last and only grow over time. During the event, the guest of honor, former first armored division commander and 18th chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, General Martin Dempsey, broke into song, receiving a standing ovation. I've always had the a very fond spot in my heart, 40 years of service. Been privileged to command Army units, uh, including the 3rd Armored Cavalry Regiment and the 1st Armored Division. So this St. George celebration is, is, uh, is really like being home. For 41 AD in Fort Bliss, I'm U.S. Army Sergeant Aaron Brady, and that's your Highlander Report.